Nigerian youth have uh, been tasked uh, to build bridges of unity and help rebuild the country. This was uh, as the All Progressives Congress uh, met at uh, the capital of Nigeria, Abuja, in a bid to chart the future of the party. Senior party leaders uh, asked the youth to be champions of a united Nigeria, shunning divisions of ethnicity, regionalism and religion. Our correspondent Amadi Uyi was there. It was the first conference by youths from Nigeria's ruling party, the All Progressives Congress. That conference with the team, the future is a decision, had leaders of the party converge on the nation's capital, Abuja, to chart a way forward with the youths as strategic partners. This event is coming at a time when our party is undergoing complete rebirth, recovery, rehabilitation, rejuvenation and repositioning. The youth of the APC stock have chosen a perfect time to interrogate the future of the youth within the progressive ideology and by so doing draw the party and its energetic youth into the arena of constructive discourse. While the conference also saw representatives from across the country in attendance, those present say the conference is strategic for the APC because it will determine the party and Nigeria's future. It is a fact that the future of our third party, the All Progressives Congress, and indeed, the country lies in our youth. So we cannot afford to discard the youth in the affairs of the party. For the first time in 20 years, President Muhammad Buhari, the name Muhammad Buhari will not be on the ballot. That means that the party will have to go and look for its votes, where the votes are residual. The president will transfer some of his votes to us. The party has transformed itself under the leadership of the National Caretaker Committee chairman. But more importantly, the votes are with young people. President Mohamed Buhari, who was represented by Nigeria's secretary to the government of the Federation, Boss Mustafa, commended the youths for their resilience and support. You are a remain not only a strong pillar of our great party, the All Progressive Congress, but also a backbone of our nation. Other speakers present took time out to advise the youths on the way to go. I want to make an appeal that remember we have a nation called Nigeria, and there's no other place on the surface of this age we can call ours other than this country called Nigeria. So you must do everything to protect the unity of this country. No matter the anger, no matter the pains, there's no other better place we can have than this country called Nigeria. The future of our nation, the future of our party depends on you. It is what you make of this future that our party can be. In the beginning of this nation, Nigeria, Last I checked, every single action towards nation building has been championed by one youth or another. APC is showing all signs of growth, all signs of growth in the real sense of it. And it is you youth that can carry the ball and move forward. They also urge them to build the nation and the APC. Nigerian youth must take responsibility. You must repackage yourself. What you see today as Nigeria use requires some serious surgery and amendments to reflect the future leaders we are looking at, both in composition and behavioral pattern. Let's build this party Kalusan by Kalusan. Let's deliver like we've delivered in 2015. Let's deliver like we delivered in 2019. Let's deliver like we'll deliver in 2023. Let's deliver like we deliver in 2027. And on and on and on. And every time the opposition think that they have something on us, we will tell them that we speak a new language of the young people. Former Abuja, Amadin Uyi, 